Hey, a pleasant good evening, everybody. This is Sports Tonight News. I'm Joe Bort. And the Ducks and Hurricanes ended up being a very lively game tonight that ended in a 2-1 to one score that the Hurricanes were able to win off of a fortunate bounce after John Gibson made a very good save that Seth Jarvis was able to get the goal. We talked about this game on Pure Wisdom's NHL Pearls of Wisdom, talking about it being a very good game that the get I guessed it on today. Follow him on Pure Wisdom, and you get to get all the NHL knowledge from 3 to 5 p.m. Eastern each day. But the Hurricanes... And Ducks really did play an even game with each other. We got to see just how much of a leader Trevor Zegers was, or is, excuse me, in this game. Um, where he's just showing how angry he was after that loss. He's a guy that just adds that different energy. Troy Terry, the guy that's just a different breed this year, playing absolutely ridiculous this year. A guy that, of course, is a former fifth-round pick, now looking like he's developing into a star and being part of the next future core with Trevor Zegers. And John Gibson played a hell of a game. But in this game, the big deciding thing was just really experience in the end. You have a team in the Carolina Hurricanes who has more, obviously, experienced catch where the Ducks are one of the youngest teams in all of hockey, and they were able to win out. You were able to get a goal by one of their youngsters in Seth Jarvis, and then earlier you were able to get a goal by somebody they brought over. A nice move they made, of course, to bring over an Ethan Bear from a side angle there, but a goal that was a very nicely picked wrist shot by him and not one that I would really blame on Gibson. One, you might want to get back to get over a little quicker, but still a very nicely placed shot by Ethan Bear. And then Troy Terry got a rebound goal, dirty but good, and then a really dirty but good goal is what Jarvis got because you were able to get a goal. Any goal was good, in other words, and he was able to get it in just off of an ugly goal after John Gibson made a beautiful um, save. <clears throat> uh, this ended the Ducks' winning streak at eight games, but Troy Terry did extend his run to 16, putting him as our third star of the game, where I would have to say in this game the two goalies are tied for second because they both played a hell of a tilt, and both played really good out there. And then when it comes to the first star of the game, you have to give that to who gets the game-winning goal, in my opinion, in most games. And Seth Jarvis also has been playing very good since coming up. He has three points in seven games and has been flying on the ice, really looking good as that undersized just offensive threat that he was projected in scouting reports in the draft. Screw size if a guy plays with that much of a compete level and that much talent and has the silky hands of Seth Jarvis and the shot of Seth Jarvis. So you got to see... That, well, not necessarily today, he's got the dirty goal, but we've got to see that since he's been called up to the NHL and he's been lighting up, obviously, every single level he's been at since um, coming up to the NHL as well and continues to perform well in the NHL. So hats off to him for being the first star, the two goalies tied for the second star, and Troy Terry extending his streak to 16. The Ducks streak snapped at 8, but this is a more experienced team being able to fight out the brute end to the debt, like win. Um, at all costs game basically and getting a dirty but good goal and that seemed like it was going to take be what it took to win this game and that goal ended up fortunately for Hurricanes fans and the Hurricanes going to them and unfortunately for Ducks fans not going to them but this was a great game by the Ducks as well to be able to stand in with the Carolina Hurricanes one of the top cup contenders where they're one of the top teams as well to start the season but I don't think people are ready to still say the Ducks are one of the top cup contenders so fantastic performance by them albeit in a losing effort and great Bob great job excuse me by the Hurricanes to be able to find a way to win this tilt so everybody have a great saving close day this from the Sports Time News reaction to the Carolina Hurricanes getting a two to one win on the goal by Seth Jarvis over the Anaheim Ducks subscribe down below or on the easy to use widget up above and also Again, follow Pure Low Wisdom for great NHL knowledge. Peace out, everybody.